Hey guys, welcome back to some more Tennis World Tour and part 8 of my career mode and today we will be taking part in the semi-final of the Ecuador National Open. Thank you very much for all the support on the series so far. Very good news is that the patch has been released on Xbox One. There, there are a few issues with the PS4 side so in this episode we haven't installed the patch and probably next episode as well. Hopefully it'll be out um, by the end of play today. Um, but but we'll see, we'll see, but it looks, I, I've read the comments and people saying it plays much better after the patch, which is great, that's what we want. Um, also, a big thank you to somebody who suggested to turn off volley preferences. Uh, I'll show you that in the sentence when we get into the match. Um, and somebody was asking to look at the tournament bracket, so if you want to have a look at the tournament bracket, feel free. Um, but yeah, yeah. Uh, I had a play around with it last night with Kyle Edmund, who's very good on this game, by the way. And I had a much better experience playing the game than I'm already having. You know, I'm, I'm really, really enjoying Tennis World Tour. I enjoy playing this more than AO Tennis. Um, but without further ado, let's get into the match. And I'll I'll show you the setting that I've turned off. And hopefully, it'll, it'll work out quite nicely. In this match, the ground strokes looked a lot better. We didn't have the whole sort of half volley business, which has been tainting the sort of episode so far. But I don't know whether that was just because I had a good player or not. Both are at the top of their game right now. It'll be a terrific struggle. <clears throat> so, uh, go into game options and this auto volley preferences. Uh, it was on yes. I've turned it now to no. So hopefully... That'll sort out um, any of the problems that we were having. Um, and also, the surf for Kyle Edmund was very good as well. Um, I'm not going to be naive and, and try and get 60% first serve again. Um, but we will try. And already, you see, we've hit two ground strokes, which is, you know, not something we were doing before. Oh, that's a good shot, though. He's sending bombs. Love 15. And uh, already it's starting to look a lot better. So I don't know um, if I accidentally turned on that setting or whether it's um, automatically on. But certainly, you know, making most things look a lot better. Oh, it hits the line. I thought we uh, we were out of position for that shot. But we played it beautifully, and it's down 15 all. Fault. That was close. That was close. We opened up the backhand side. We went for it. It didn't quite pay off. I mean, that shot there should have been enough to win it. But, uh, you know, yeah. And somebody also let me know that the pink shoes were Federer's. So I thought we'd put them on uh, just to match the outfit. And I think they, they look pretty good. Uh, and I think we're looking pretty good, actually. You know, I think... Um, Hopefully it should be a lot better to watch now as well that we've uh, turned off that volley preferences and and we can really have some fun with this game now. Obviously, if you've watched me AO Tennis uh, video from earlier today, you'll know um, I'm very frustrated with that game at the moment. What a shot that is, by the way. Um, and therefore it's on sort of an indefinite hiatus. Until they fix it so that every second shot doesn't go out, I will not be playing that game. So that means we're going to play the hell out of this game instead. Which I'm really happy about because I prefer this game, in all honesty. I know a lot. it's an unpopular opinion, but I think this game is better. Personally. Come on. I mean, what a rally this is. 
Oh, we miss it. Ah, oh, we had the whole court there. That was frustrating. Deuce now. It's his yes. Now would be a great time for I risked it by coming forward, but it paid off. Advantage now. Uh, oh, that was going out, but he kept it in. Oh, we didn't take advantage, though. That was a shame. Fault. Unlucky there. What a shot that is. What a shot that is. Absolutely fantastic. Fault. Yes, we've won the won the point. And there we go. One nil after four minutes. Perfect shot. 15. Oh, what a shot. What a shot that is. 15 all. Fabulous. Wow. Incredible. I didn't Even the crowd were getting into that one. <laughs> and we know the crowd don't make a lot of noise. Fault. Fault. Two break points. He's got to keep the pressure on the return. Well, double fault. Yes, we've done it. A beautiful return winner there. 2-0 now. And we're serving for this first set already. Fault. Good shot. I didn't even see the ball. That was a rocket. Fault. Oh dear. Fifteen all. Tried my best just to place that one, but that didn't quite work. Come on. Brilliant. tennis perfection. Thirty fifteen. Fault. Oh, that's what we're talking about. What a beautiful shot that was. 40, 50. Set point now. Yes, we've done it. it. He couldn't quite get it back. I'd have rather that we'd won it more conventionally, but never mind. 3-0, we win that set. That was really, really good. And I have heard somebody said in the comments that they've um, played into their second season. And in the, the higher tournaments, we play longer matches. And the players get uh, more difficult as they go on, which is fantastic. What a shot that was, by the way. Let's have a look at this on the replay. 
because uh, I think this will look good. He threw it up. And we absolutely walloped that backhand for a winner. Love 15. Oh, nice serve. Nice serve. 15 all. Oh, and again. <laughs> we tried to um, go out wide for that one. He's mixing it up a little bit now. But you feel like once we're in the point where the favourites... Oh, a little drop shot. Surely he's not going to reach it. Oh, he does. He does, but we hit the passing shot down the line. And there we go. 30 all now. 30 all. Fault. Beautiful shot once again. That's two backhand winners we've hit in this, uh, or backhand return winners, I should say, in this game. Break point now. Yes, we've done it. It hits the line. It's 1-0. And you have to say that was a little bit too easy. But, uh, it's fine. Yeah. Oh, it hits. Uh, it, it's out. I mean, <laughs> I'm losing me words here. <laughs> uh, somebody saying down in the comments that uh, I was a very good commentator. I, I really do appreciate that. <laughs> um, yeah, but sometimes I do trip over my words a bit. So, um, yeah. Oh, I think that was going out again. Brilliant. We worked that point so well. Are we going to see a replay of it? Look at this. Lovely little uh, forehand cross court. He gets it back, but we just hit it down the line. We ease it there. Good stuff. Fault. Out. Went for it. Goes wide. 15, Not enough control 30. on the shot. Fault. Fault. He has to oh dear. Two points to keep his break. Dear me. Break points here. Two of them. Fault. And all of a sudden, our server's gone off a little bit. I feel like it has improved in this match, but uh, it has gone off just a little bit in this game, and that's out. Well, maybe this game isn't going to be as easy as we first thought. Chance here. Good shot. Wow. That one had some pepper on it. Love, 15. Chance. Oh, I don't like winning points like that because I feel like it's just down to... A glitch in the game, but uh, never mind. Out. Oh. The forehand goes wide. 15, Not enough control on the 30. shot. Chance. Out. How could he miss? Oh, that and again. Just hitting a couple of loose ones, which is a, which is a shame. Oh, what a shot that is, though. What a fabulous backhand that was. Let's just have a look at this on the replay. The serve 
was pretty decent, but we absolutely smashed it back. Break point here. And if we win it, we'll be serving for the match. I'll tell you what, we're a man on a mission here. Ah! <laughs> and as I say that, we make a mistake. <laughs> oh, dear. This time we had a forehand winner. That was even better, in my opinion. Shall we have a look at this on the replay? Lovely. Absolutely lovely. Down the line. Break point once again. Oh, what a serve. What a serve. Juice. That's what we're talking about. A nice approach shot and a good volley to finish it off. Break point. Number three. Yes, we've done it. And there, that's it. We've broke. That was the break point. And now, 2-1 up, serving for a place in our second consecutive final. Bolt. <sighs> tell you what, that just hit the line. Good shot. Fifteen. Come on. Fault. Again, a bit of a wayward uh, serve. How can he have so much power? Thirty. Love. Brilliant. What a shot that was. Three match points now. What a shot that was. Fault. And again, look at that. What a beautiful shot. He's dead again. After seven games, he's completely dead. Uh, let's have a look at what the game thinks was our best rally. Uh, and apparently it was that. Uh, I disagree. But uh, there you go. 37% first serve. I thought it was a little bit better than that. But never mind. 28 winners. 10 on 4 errors. 3 of our 5 break points won. 2 of 2 points at the net. So, yeah, not coming forward as much. Which is good to see, actually. It means that we're winning it from the baseline. Which is really, really positive to see. Uh, 29 points to 16 and there we go we should be moving up a level as well which is very very good um, got some money in the bank so there you know we've got another uh, thing we've got another agent okay a new agent unlocked so we'll maybe have a look at that um, after this all the way what's this uh, Regained at the start of the point, but movement speed decreased. Okay, and passive bonus improved. We've got our coach up to level two, which is great to see. So we've got the final against Kaito Ueno in the next round. And I tell you what, we'll have a look at the uh, agent and stuff in the next episode. No, we won't. We won't. We'll have a look now. Uh, so let's have a look um, at details. So we can possibly have an agent. Let's have a look. So your agent or financial advisor helps you manage and optimize your revenue so you never go bankrupt. In Tennis World Tour, each agent provides a specific career bonus and unlocks different career activities. So this guy, Nicola, is a former internationally known attorney. He has met all the biggest captains of industry. A rugby specialist, he developed the Springbook Springbok's uh, image worldwide um, before return to his first love, tennis. The passive effect matches in train increase your experience by 
10%. Um, well, we might as well hire him. I don't see any harm in uh, having him for now. So we've got an agent now, which is very, very cool. Um, we've obviously got that new skill as well. We can apply our new skill points. So what are we going to go for? Uh, so if we went for attack, that would improve every, pretty much all of these. Um, yeah, the only thing it, it wouldn't necessarily do is, is um, that there. I think we go for attack because we are quite an attacking player. So let's try and base ourselves around being attacking. Because um, we're not having to defend much at the moment. We'll maybe utilise these a little bit later down the line. But, um, I mean, would serve... Hmm. Nah, we'll go for that. I think that's the best one to go for. Um, and so we'll confirm that. And uh, yeah, that is where we're going to leave this episode. So if you have enjoyed, make sure you leave a like down below. It really does mean a lot for me. And it really does help out the channel as well. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.